You would think they wouldn't just go too wild with the with the amps, you know? Here we go. Let's fix this thing. I'm just gonna look at it first. Need some rope. But that board I found is too long. Cut it down, boy! The board is good, but I need some rope. Oh my god. Where do I find rope at then? Anything? No. Maybe inside. I need me some rope, please. Shoe bucket, rope. Gotta be some rope. Aye. Some duck. This rope is perfect for the swing. So I'm talking about late. Hey. Oh, I can go inside. Let's try to go inside then. Hi. Hey, hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. <sighs> How many rooms? How many rooms does this house have? Rooms? Why do you ask? Uh, just curious, I guess. Uh, uh, just curious, I guess. Let's not start thinking too far ahead now. Let's just focus on getting y'all a good home-cooked meal tonight. Well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. Well, Lee, I sure appreciate it. No problem. Uh, 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 I'm not done here. There was a couple other questions I want to ask her. It looks like she's been picking out in the meals. You seen the size of her? Hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? When will dinner be ready? It'll be a while still, but it'll be worth it. Trust me. Okay. How's your family been holding up since, uh, you know? All my boys have been my saving grace. They both left their jobs and came home to help out after the attack started happening. I think it was hardest on Andy. Dan was always more of a mama's boy. But don't tell him I said that. <laughs> <laughs> Your family's done an amazing job of keeping this place up. Well, now aren't you sweet? Thank you, Lou. The boys and I have tried to adapt as best we can, but we still keep some of our old routines to help remind us of better times. Uh, yeah, what happened your staff? What happened to the rest of your staff? Oh, we've had our share of tragedy here. Just like everyone else, I'm sure. Some of our staff took off to find their family as soon as they heard the news. The few that stuck around, well, we lost most of them the first night those things showed up here. It was a tough night. Well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. Well, Lee, I sure appreciate it. No problem. No problemo. Alrighty, we're done here. Let's fix that thing. The swing. Wow, 53 minutes already. Holy shit. I've got shit. some rope that should work. But that board I found is too long. Alright. This shouldn't be too tough. Well, I'll be damned. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it, too. Did you say something, darling? Oh, my goodness. Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. Uh, Lee, how do you know? All fixed. That should make everyone happy. How do you know? All fixed. That should hmm? make everyone happy. Well, I guess. Oh, we'll speak to Mark, see if he says anything else. And I guess we'll do the perimeter thing. Hey, 
Okay. Sup. The fence is no joke, at least around the house. I'm looking forward to seeing the rest of it. I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. Okay. I guess we're ready to rock and roll then. Use gate. Oh, there's a gate right here. Hey, uh, what are you fixing to do around the barn? Uh, da, 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 I'm trying to help. Just trying to find more ways to help out. Well, I appreciate that. Tell you what, we'll find you something to do over there after we get back from securing the perimeter. Sounds good. Ah. Oh. I'm still a little, you know, I just feel like they're, they're hiding something a little bit. Hi. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. All right, let's go then. Okay, this is good. I like this. Story is really good. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. What's up with you telling him what I said about him thinking I'm dangerous? Look, you said it. You even admitted it right to him. Huh. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. Sure, I should have called him a piece of shit. Oh, there's one. God, he's got an auto in him. Ugh. Right through his face Lee, and everything. It's dead. Come on, let's push it off. With your bare hands? Who do you think he was? Hmm. Maybe a farmhand. I don't know. I hope he wasn't like this long before the fence finished him off. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. I agree. Disgusting. There's not even any blood on it, surprisingly. Let's go then, push. Oh, he's pushing with the axe, good guy. Good guy. Come on, I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Uh, it's useless. Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Uh, what do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks. There's another one. I see it. How could you not see it? <laughs> this one's like right on it. Uh, ah, it's hanging on. Let's go for a springboard action here. Man, the fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. Fuck. Man, the fence uh, burned right thing. into its hands. I think they fused together. Okay, choppy chop time. Larry the axe. <laughs> oh, fuck. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Nope. How did it even chop there? Christ. Can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. 
It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Uh. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Oh, Come on, shit. help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> hmm. Wouldn't you rather pull it up now? Little help here, Lee? If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. Huh. Just looking, just observing the sitch. Here we go, here we go then. Let's go! Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on! Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here! Oh, fuck! What the? Get to the gate! Holy shit! Oh my god. What the hell? Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out. Where's our food, you asshole? Food? Give us the food. Get closer. Whoa, my god. Hi. Oh man, I hit the tractor. Let's push it. We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Push it then. That's to be the worst push I've ever seen in my life. I already got one of you. Come on. You fuck with us. Now we'll take what we want. What? Do... Did you really got a dear touch? The plates are stuck in the dirt. What do I do then? Oh, here we go. No fuel. Of course. What about an arrangement? Of course. Uh. Oh, here we go. Cool chalk. Oh, here we go then. Here we go. No. Can I detach it now? Give it the food. Behind the track. Oh, here we go. Go. Pull it, pull it, pull it. Oh, fuck. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Sick. Oh my god, here we go. Keep going. He should get closer to the other guy, Mark. What about our arrangement? Yeah, screw your arrangement. Fuck. We're doing good, we're doing good. Oh no. What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. We're gonna have to move it. Ah, uh, what? Here we go. Let's go, let's go. Go and we're going back to the dairy farm, you muckers. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? Two. Pretty sure it was two. Oh no! He's alive! How? Oh god. Yes, in the face. In the fucking face. Come on. Oh no, he's trying to bite me! He's trying to bite me! Fuck off! Oh! Okay? Yeah. Come on. Oh man. The gate's right there. Oons, oons, oons. Check this shit. Check my dance. Oons, oons. He's still alive. He's half fucking body and everything. Fuck you, sir. Beat deserve. Oh, nice. Let's get out of here. Go, run. Close the gate then. Oh my god. 
So he fucking turned the thing on while we was still there. What the fuck is he playing at? Fuck are you playing at? What's wrong? The electric fence came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit, are, are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? Oh, shit. Those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. But God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark! Oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on, Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Pull it out? Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. So much for your deal. Those shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were going to give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. Listen, we may have had an you. agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I agree. We'll get out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's <laughs> real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hmm, that's a... That's a good deal. What was that about? Hey, kids! Look what Lee got working for you. A swing! I love swings! Just like at my treehouse! Come on, Doc! Thanks, Lee. You're the best. Yeah! <laughs> You're the best, Clem. Well, I guess we can start speaking to people again.